Hey everyone, Kid is Sean here. So I'm actually recording from my car right now, but I am here at the legendary Frankensons here in Southern California. And uh, I actually am gonna be doing a challenge today. So I saw, you know what, this actually sounds fun. I might wanna do this maybe every other week or once a month kind of thing, but I'm gonna go ahead and limit myself to $100 today to buy Pokemon cards, whether it's boxes, packs, or singles. Most likely it's gonna be all the singles because I like singles. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and limit myself to $100. And um, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and show off Frankenstein's a little bit and um, show all my singles that I bought at the end of the video. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and head into Frankenstein's. Alright, so I just sold a bunch of Digimon cards right now and uh, I was not expecting to get a lot of money out of it. Uh, the dude gave me 500 for my cards, which I find insane. I'm like, yeah, sure, I'll take it. And uh, yeah, I have a stack of cash right here. So, I'm a happy man. 15 bucks for all three, eh, not too bad. All right, so I'm here at Teresa's Collectibles. I'm actually gonna sell some Weiss cards. Hopefully I can make some good money. All right, so uh, wasn't able to make too much money for Weiss, uh, but I mean, it's always nice to talk to uh, Mike at Teresa's because uh, he, I mean, we've been playing Weiss for a really long time. Uh, I wanted to buy some singles off of him for Saikano, but he didn't have any as of right now, but hopefully next week he'll have them. But uh, yeah, Saikano deck incoming. All right, so here's my second pickup for Pokemon. The wick was actually out of my budget range. Um, I didn't want to pay what they were asking for. Uh, the Marnie um, kind of surprised me. I didn't know it was like $30. I thought it was like less than that. But I mean, I still wanted a Marnie pickup today. So got a Marnie, I uh, got some other ones. I do want to pick up some Pokemon Go uh, trainers, which uh, I am going to another booth right now to pick those up because I saw a booth that did have all of them, so let's we'll see if I can get the rest in a bundle deal. But all together, this was uh, $50. All right guys, so I am done for the day. So I made a pretty good deal with one of the vendors here. Um, he sold me the Pokemon Center Lady for 10 and everything else for $2 each, making it uh, 30, no, 40 total. So this is 40, so we had 60 left or we spent 60 and then we had 40 left over so this is a total of 40 dollars right here so yeah i've got a bunch of cards that uh i wanted or i don't have yet so very happy i'm missing one of the pokemon go trainers but next time next time but yeah that's going to be about it for this video all right guys so this is actually a voice recording over an image that i took with my phone the reason why they are sorted like they are in the image in front of you is because i wanted to separate them uh, by vendor. So the three cards on the bottom, the Thornton, Zisu, and a Gardenia, I got that with a total of 15. For some reason, I thought I got it for 10 after I recorded that uh, video of me purchasing them. So the total of everything here is actually 105. So um, kind of went over the budget a little bit, but it's okay. Um, as you saw in the video, I did make a lot of money selling my Digimon cards as well as my Wise cards. So I thought I, I think it might be okay and um, that I, I just miscalculated basically but uh, those three cards we got it for 15 the cards above the Marnie again that kind of surprised me I didn't know that it was like in the $30 range I thought it was actually a little bit cheaper but um, that row right there I was able to purchase it for a total of $50 and then the uh, two rows above um, again like I said in the video the vendor gave me a really good deal uh, he told me hey buy the Pokemon Center Lady for 10 which was the full price he was selling it at. I think Pokemon Center Lady would usually go around 10 to 12 from if I'm not mistaken but he was like hey buy the Pokemon Center Lady for 10 and also everything else 
for two dollars each and i was like yeah that's a deal dude so um a lot of those cards are somewhat harder to get like i actually haven't seen a bird keeper in a while as well as kui so um, i was like yeah I'll, I'll gladly take those cards so um they're not the more expensive trainers but um basically you know trainers that i don't have and there are a lot of trainers that are really cheap and again i i just thought like this is actually a really good haul for a hundred bucks in my opinion at least like if you buy a hundred dollars worth of packs you're not guaranteed to get all these cards like th like i collect trainers so um yeah i, I got a hundred dollars worth of trainers like i mean there's one you know trainer gallery in there like pokemon in there i do click trainer gallery pokemon as well which i still am collecting a bunch um i'm almost done which is crazy uh i, I still need to collect some alt arts as well but yeah this is a total of 105 dollars again a little bit over the budget but uh i gotta remember that um hey uh, and I, I need to keep track basically like again i thought the first three cards that i purchased was ten dollars for some reason like even though i said 15 in the video uh when i i think when i was purchasing the cards on top i was like oh okay this is probably I, I probably did 10 and 50 so that's a total of 60 for the first two rows and then i was like yeah let's go with the 40 kind of thing but um i, I still think this is a good uh, a good haul in my opinion um, and by the way, uh, this is actually an October video. I recorded this in October. So my November $100 challenge will be coming up probably sometime next week. So look forward to that. And yes, we are going to be going to Frankenstein's once again because Frankenstein's is awesome. And maybe I'll, I, I might actually make the video a little longer for you guys to, you know, to check it out. But uh, yeah, that's basically going to be about it. Comment down below and tell me if you guys think I got a really good haul. And I will see you guys in the next one. Laters.